Look at who it is. It's the queen herself, Madame Karula, and I have good news for you too, is that both Shongile and Hosanna are here as well. But they seem to have been heading off a little bit further, going on an adventure of their own. So we'll try and get a view of them. As you can see, Mom is keeping a close eye on her little ones and I think she's pulling those faces because perhaps they're moving too far away and we're quite a distance away from her so I know that if she's not doing it towards us and David I've seen some impala yes look here straight through those bushes can you see between that uh, silver cluster leaf that's dead if you go straight down there they are look at that oh Karula I wonder if she's going to see these impala. Isn't this exciting? We haven't seen a leopard in ages. And not only did we get to see, of course, the beautiful Nkahumas, but now we've got our spotted cat. Now, those impala, I don't think they know that she's here. She's walking straight in that direction now. So this should be quite exciting. She's going to pop up just over here. I'm just going to duck down. She's coming through there, those beautiful spots that camouflage her so well. And I'm glad that the queen is back and she's going north. What are you looking at up that tree? I think that's where the little ones went. I'm going to go forward because I think I can get a view of, of the youngsters. Let's have a look. Oh, there they are. I'm going to move up a little bit forward. I'm going to try and predict their behavior here, just because otherwise it's going to be quite difficult. I'm so happy to hear that you're all happy. Now she's getting close to these impala. I don't think she's seen them yet. I'm going to go a little bit further forward because we've got a lovely gap. There we go. We've got little Shongile. Look at there she is. Now Hosanna, if I'm not mistaken, is further into the thicket. He's just a bit in front. But that looks like Shungile. She's a lot more slight than her big bulky brother. He's almost double her size. She, he's actually walking in the distance. I don't know if you can see him. There he is. There's Hosanna. Isn't that fantastic to see that these beautiful cubs that are nine months old are happy and healthy. They look stunning. And the Impala do not know that this leopard is here. Now, I want to just sit here quietly just for a moment because we, we, we're quite close to uh, these Impala. They're going, she's coming out, and I hope now she's going to be able to see. Oh, listen, listen. She's growling. Not, I don't think she's growling at us, but we'll just sit quietly. She's going straight to the Impala. Straight there. Don't make a noise, Garula. They're going to hear you. Here they go. She's seen them. Ah, she's been spotted. The Impala are now bounding away from her. Oh, and I think that she just unfortunately spotted those Impala just too late. And I need to just very quickly reposition. I just want Andrew to be able to see as well. So I'm just going to pull off the road slightly. And then Andrew can take my spot and then he can have a view of the cubs. But that was a pity, but I think she's going to keep pushing on and hopefully keep looking for these Impala. Now, sorry, Hunter, you wanted to know how old Karula is. For some bizarre reason, I've completely forgotten, but the age of 11 seems to be sticking in my head. Maybe I'm wrong, maybe I'm right, I'm not sure. 12 hours, oh, one off. Thanks, Rebecca. I was close. 12. I don't know why I was for, always forget that, uh, for, forget her age. Let me write it down again. Now, 
Those Impala are going to run for the hills, of course. And I suspect she's going to have to try her luck for something else. 